Isn't it insane that it takes one million years for glass to break down? So it literally outlives mankind. Yeah, that's right. And that's even longer than it takes plastic to break down. Mm -hmm. But also, do you know that in Singapore, there's like 74,000 tons of waste glass made in this country every year and at least only about 13% of that is actually recycled. What I'm trying to do at Refined is to educate people about how to reuse glass and upcycle glass. So please come on down to our studio. Why do you do what you do? So I was actually had got some new neighbours and they drank a lot of wine <laughs> and it was them that said why don't you do something with our bottles and I was going mm, okay and just fell in love and just went that's what I'm going to do for the rest of my life. It was during COVID actually that I did a 30 day challenge which is on my Instagram where I blew a different type of packaging glass every day for 30 days. So I think it's really great that uh, Bombay Sapphire, they're using 30% upcycled glass, in recycled glass in their yes, mix. In their bottles, right? That's really exciting for me yes. actually, because yes. I know what that means. What do you particularly like about this glass? What I really love about it is the colour, actually. The colour comes from copper, the element copper. Mm -hmm. And uh, at first they actually were painting white bottles that, that colour. But now the glass is actually made with the copper, right. so it's blue all the way through. So that makes it so, so suitable for upcycling and reusing. It's not just the glass either, it's the, the labels. And they're certified with the Forestry Stewardship Council. That's right. Cocktail making. That's right. The main ingredient being the Bombay Sapphire Gin. Yep. Lemon Cinnamon Gin and Tonic. Cheers. Cheers. Hot day, hot surroundings, you know. Beautiful so, cocktail. Exactly. Mm. What's your favorite output? What, what do you like creating? Where do you draw inspiration? I really like large-scale installations, actually. I've yeah. done a, quite a few in Singapore. And what I like to do is make a beautiful installation within a space that communicates with the space. Mm -hmm. And I'm developing some product with Bombay Sapphire, which is a great collaboration, making unique pieces for them. These are the bottles. Yes. This is the starting material, yes. the raw material. And then we can make the, these things out of it. I think it's really good for businesses too, if they want to be more sustainable, to approach artists to see what they can do with their product to really highlight the beauty that can be made out of the bottles that they would normally throw away. Yeah. But have you found any challenges, obstacles in trying to do what you do? And the challenge is also the interesting part, the research and development, figuring out how to work with the glass, how to prepare the glass before you work with it. All of that is sort of a challenge. Well, I'm just pretty excited to be working with upcycled bottles. Excited to be working with Bombay, developing new products for them uh, that are unique, a new unique range for them. And products that can be used every day. Yes, yes. that's right. <laughs> Thank you so much, Jane. It's been a pleasure. Thanks. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>